<laughs> Miss Mike. Thought you said you could go get some crates up with me so I could stand up. You know I'm too short, man. <laughs> well, um, um, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. First off, um, before I start off with my speech, um, I would like to say Georgetown and my kids, um, Student Creed. Today, this new day, I am a successful student. Overnight, my mind and body has produced thousands of cells to give me the greatest advantage possible. I am born anew, revitalized, and full of energy. I am rare and valuable, unique in this entire universe. I am nature's greatest miracle in action. I have unlimited potential. I believe in my abilities, attitudes, and goals. I am worthy greatness because I am the most important person in my world. I am positive and I am a positive and successful student. I believe in my I, I I live life to the fullest by experience, life without limits. I embrace life. I approach each class, each book, each assignment with enthusiasm, happiness, and joy. I thirst for knowledge. I look forward to believing and reading this creed each and every day. I am a positive and successful student. I now know each step I must take to continue to be that way. I am clear on all my goals and see myself reaching them. See myself reaching them. I am, see myself. I see myself reaching them. I now realize my infinity potential. Thus, my burning lights. I smile aloud. I am. I have become the most greatest person in the world. I would now start my speech. My name is Zuri Koki. I am 12 years old from Sumter, South Carolina. I would like to begin with my behavior prior to coming to end my kids Georgetown. When I was at home, I refused to follow the rules and obey the rules I had at home. I, I committed serious crimes in my community. The choices I made put me and my family in danger. I did not think about this at this time. I kept doing things and I didn't think about me getting hurt or even getting killed because I was taking things that belonged to someone else. At home, I was also disrespectful to my mother and did not do what she asked. A few months later, I was sent to end my kids' Georgetown during three to six months. When I arrived at the program, I was also disrespectful and, and refused to follow the rules and expectations at the program. I liked to fight, but then I realized there were no fighting at the program. However, I was able to get in the fight with a peer. Man, I was sorry. The staff, the staff there, Mr. William Wigfall, Mr. Eric Wright, and Mr. Michael Wright, talked to me a long time about not trying to prove myself or proving someone wrong. It's about how you conduct yourself and learn to think before you act. After I started believing this, I realized that fighting doesn't make you a man. Walking away is more character of a man. While in the program, I was informed that my mother was put in prison for assault and battery, and I would be placed in the custody of my aunt and my grandmother. This was very hurtful. Not that I don't love my grandmother or my auntie, but it's because my mom is now incarcerated. She is not able to receive my letters from me, but the staff at my kids, Georgetown, are very considerate. They make sure that I receive my letters and are there for me if I needed to talk. I love my mother and that I can always say I didn't listen to her for a while while I was at home. I changed. We had Bible study weekly in the program, and one thing that I have learned, you should honor that mother, that father, your days upon this earth will be long. That's something I really thought about long and hard. The staff members at AMR Kids Georgia are more than a family than just staff. They talk to you about your problems, help you find your solution, and learn more about yourself. They continuously encourage us as students and challenge us to do our best and be our best. As a result of my relationship with staff, the AMR, the staff with the staff at AMR Kids Georgia. I've earned a rank and also a furlough at home. At AMI my kids, Georgetown, I learned that if you, if you try, you can, I can be successful and achieve my goals. Since my behavior, since since the change in my behavior and my attitude, I must admit good things have started coming my way. Thank you, AMI my kids, Georgetown.